Hey guys, it's Nikki. Welcome back to my channel. Or welcome to my channel if you're new. And in today's video, as you can tell by the title, we are going to be trying Dollar Tree hair products. Okay. So basically, I was in Dollar Tree and I was like, oh my god, like I should have some hair products. So I got a few. Last time I went and I did a haul, which you can go check out, I did get like a gel from there. So if I find it around here, I might use it, but if not, you know, whatever. I was intrigued, so here is the bag of goodies. I mean, there's other stuff in here, but let's just take out the hair stuff, so. First, what I have here is this L'Oreal Colorista Spray. It's one day color for hints and highlights. It's in shade Gold 03. I don't think I'm gonna try this yet, but I did want to see if it would do like something like, you know, to my hair even though it's dark so if you guys want to see me try this in the video let me know but I'm not trying it today um I found an edge brush which I found very interesting because first of all I better not be used why would it be used um I found it interesting because I got mine from Amazon I don't remember it just being a dollar could have been a dollar and some change but um yeah so they have it where it has a little like I have it right here it's literally the same exact brush and they have the one in pink as well but the only difference is this one is kind of goes from smaller to bigger where this one is just a consistent bigger length um but yeah so i thought i'd try it out i got this salon selectives curl control curl stretch cream it's sulfate free enriched with shea butter Apply a dime size amount to sections of wet hair. My hair. I also got this Lusty Oil Moisturizing Hair Lotion. It eliminates dryness and breakage, softness and shine, softens and shines, non greasy, direction shake well for ample amount of Lusty Oil Moisturizer Hair Lotion to palm of hand, rub hands together and apply to hair use daily or as needed comb or style as desired interesting um i got this v05 kiwi lime squeeze with lemongrass extra hold on lemongrass you know i don't know what it smells like but it doesn't smell bad but it doesn't smell the best but i used to use v05 a lot when i was younger that it was at dollar tree and i was like give me the shampoo conditioner i mean did it do much for my hair no but um you know i had this curl stretch cream i didn't really have a leave-in conditioner so i wanted to use it as such um and then i have this curl stretch cream from shea solutions made with organic shea butter it moisturizes and strengthens to maximize curls i just realized i got two curl stretch creams Whichever one smells better, I'll use. So let's smell the salon selectives. <laughs> the Shea Better one smells much better than this. I don't know what the hell, okay? Hey, yeah, and then I got me a little turkey to color, but that has nothing to do with my hair. And then I got a Freeman clear pomegranate face mask because I want to try because it, it says it's a clearing and um, we have acne so in using the products in front of me we're gonna try so I'm basically gonna do three steps so what I think I'm gonna do is I'm going to put the slightest amount of conditioner put the hair lotion and then the curl stretch cream as like my styler and um, we're gonna see if this works and then I'm gonna do my edges um, I'm gonna go find the gel that I did get from Dollar Tree because I saw it there but I was like why would I waste a dollar on getting something I already have so I'm gonna go find it and then that'll be used for my edges even though I, I don't think it's a good gel for edges and then we're gonna use the edge brush that we have from there so that's different so if you guys wanna see what it's all what it's all with the crew then please keep watching so i can't find the exact one but it was the ampro style gel it was the white cap either white or black cap but it was just a really small one but this is just a big one that i have so 
it's the same product but I'm gonna use it I'm going to remove my wig now keep your thoughts to yourself thank you so here we are no believe it or not I did wash my hair last night so that's why um, I put the wig on because I was like girl I don't feel like doing nothing and then this came about so was that God being like girl you're gonna film today so first what I'm gonna do is what I always do I'm gonna comb my hair out a bit it looks like it's like straightened or less defined because um, I couldn't find my comb so I brushed it with a regular brush and it just and then I stuck it under a wig cap for the entire night so here we are but you know whatever we're gonna see if these products can bring out the curls I do not feel like um, cutting is awesome I'm gonna use their edge brush Jesus I look a mess and I'm gonna take the Ampro style down I'm gonna do my edges I don't I don't know. I'm gonna take what's on the top. I'm gonna add it to like the side part to help stick it down or slick it down. I used to be so obsessed with this gel. It was kind of unhealthy. Like I needed this like sophomore um, year of high school type. Oh my god, I needed this girl. For what, I have no idea because hair was a mess, but I needed her. I guess when I was wearing my natural hair to put it out. See, I don't think this would be kind of good for edges because um, it's brown and like I can see the brown like on my face, you know, like I don't, it's not my vibe. Gel used, this gel used to slick the hell out of my hair when I needed me a nice little little bun or whatever. So, I'm confused. The smell is so nostalgic of it. Of the gel. I will say, this brush is quite similar to the one on Amazon. If not, it's a bit softer. Like, this brush is a bit softer but also you know I've been using the other one for a little bit so product is built on it a little bit so maybe that's why I'm feeling that way because like this is extremely rough but this one is extremely soft I don't remember if it was that soft this is the it's literally the same brush this one just has a little bit of a different tip and has like the I was gonna say ombre y'all know it has like the the comb goes from small to big big to small okay that's that I wouldn't use this gel for my edges but this is really good for like your buns and to slick down even though I do love me some eco style I feel like it hydrates my hair as well but this is a good one it's alcohol and paraben free I've used this for years so I would recommend next we're gonna go in with some leave-in conditioner. let me take off this rain girl cuz no we're, we're gonna go in with some leave-in conditioner aka just regular conditioner and I'm gonna use the vo5 kiwi lime squeeze with lemon Oh my god, that just poured into my hand with Kimi, Kimi, Kiwi Lemongrass Extract. Oh, I, so, I was supposed to wet my hair. Okay. Well, I'm putting the conditioner in and then afterwards I'm going to spray my hair with my water sprayer with my spray bottle because I need to wet it to, you know, style it. I mean, it definitely made my hair soft just now, like, um, putting it in. So, yeah. But let's dampen it. With some water. I'm gonna use just a tad bit more hopefully it's so it's so watery I wonder why like it's so watery I'm gonna kind of like scrunch it and such going on I feel like I look like an old lady do I if I do lie to me tell me I don't it's fine okay 
this ain't my last product okay good because next we have the i'm gonna shake this because the luck the lusty oil moisturizer hair lotion i knew it was gonna be pink it literally has no scent okay well we're gonna moisturize this hair now It literally has zero scent. It has a pretty color though. Did I show you guys here? Like it has like a really pretty like hot pink color to it. I did not need to add more, but here we are. I look old. What the freak is going on with my, I don't know. I don't have to explain it. I feel like my hair is just not looking the best cool and lastly we're gonna go into the curl stretch cream by shea Sh solutions why is this oh my god this is so watery i don't know i thought it would be more like a well it is a cream but i thought it'd be more gel like for some reason i'm going to crunch my curls while i apply this product in Yeah, I don't know. Why is this so like, I don't know. I expected such a different consistency with this product. Um, I don't know. Ooh, not me adding too much product. Now my hair getting white. <laughs> um. Girl, hold on. I feel like the products did not do much. Like my hair looks like I just wet it. But I'm not seeing much of a, you know, I don't know. I mean, the curls are there, but like they came after I wet my hair. So, you know, I'm, I'm very conflicted. I'm conflicted. Let me take a fin thumbnail because I'm conflicted. Girl, anyways. <laughs> I don't like it. I don't know if it's the products or the way my hair is right now, but I feel like it's the, I don't know. Um, I, It's crazy to me because the gel I would use to slick down my hair, but I don't feel like it did anything really for my edges. I, I don't know. I, I, I don't think I'd use that product for my edges. I would use it to do a nice slick ponytail, but other than that, I don't think I'd use it. Um, I think the product that I probably liked the most was the... I think the oil moisturizer will have like a good effect on my hair i think i would try it again because like i do have dry spots in my head like especially in the middle um the least effective i feel like was the curl stretch cream because curl stretch cream i don't know i just i guess i assumed it was gonna be like a a gel or like more of a cream that was gonna have like a harder finish to really you know make the curls just and you know defined but I don't know. I mean, my curls don't look bad. They were definitely coming out, but I, I've, I have products that do more. So I, I'm not, I'm not impressed. But um, you guys, let me know what you guys think down below of how my hair looks. I don't know. I mean, it looks a little white because there's just a little bit of product buildup, but that happens to me sometimes because sometimes I just I can't do it. But you guys, let me know down below what you guys think of my hair um, because I. <laughs> I don't know if I like it, but you guys let me know. I don't know. I think I definitely tried the oil, the hair oil, this pink one, because it's pink. But also, I, I think it's a good moisturizer. Like, my hair feels moisturized, but I don't know. Like, I see the curls, but I don't feel like they're, like, defined, you know? Um, the curl stretch cream, I don't think it did too much. The conditioner, girl, it just made my hair soft. And I mean, that's conditioner for you i guess so don't forget to like this video comment down below what you guys think or any good dollar tree finds that you find for curly hair let me know um and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and if there's any more videos that you guys want to see like this of me trying a specific brand a specific place please let me know for curly hair products and 
yeah, I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.